Uh, okay, and uh, first, to make sure that you use one piece of tracing paper, first I use a 11 by 17 to give you an overall size uh, how big this one. So, make sure this one we are going to use inch and foot. See? We are going to use a quarter inch. Okay, quarter inch. Quarter inch, one fourth, okay. One fourth, quarter inch, one fourth. If you want to move closer, you can move closer, okay, yeah. One fourth. Draw. The layout, pre draw, this is your assignment. You can lay out like this, or lay out like this, either way. So right now, I plan to lay out like this. Okay, I plan to lay out like this. Anyway. If you working for horizontal, right now it's better than vertical. Because horizontal you get a more advantage. Okay? So either this way or either this way. So I plan to working like this. Okay. This object overall move up and measure. At first I measure this column. Use a straight edge. Okay. Okay, I believe here's column. You push harder. Take a look at red color, so now you can read. I use red color. Okay, I use red color. It's more easy to read. Here to here. Here to here. Take a look at. So this is not a final. This is not a final. Okay. So for my for my works here to here, depend on this is a column. So I give it. So here to here, which is a. You can see here 20, 27 and a half. 27 and a half. 27, 28, depend on your observation. Okay, depending on your observation. Okay. Okay, so red color. So these two column. And also this part. And uh, I have these two column. So next step. You get so which is from here to here, how far is it? You measure, okay? You measure after that, one for A, one for the six. Okay, one for the six, okay, finally. And also I tell you, the wall thickness, last the class I mentioned about the wall thickness, that's uh, uh, one, for the th one for the three, one for the four. One for, I would say one for the three, one for the three, which is a, uh, uh, 15 inch, 12 plus 3, 15 inch. One for the three, you can find it from here. Quarter inch here to here, one foot, three, three, six, nine, twelve. So one foot, three. You can find that. Okay. So mirror that, one foot, three. Okay, one foot. Mirror that one for three. Okay, what thickness could be four and a three quarter? Could be, but we round it to five. Round it to five inch. Okay, so you can find a five five inch from scale. Okay, but find the center point, center line. Okay, five five. Okay, mark down. Okay, mark down. Then you move it. Okay, you can slide, make it a little bit longer. Okay, here, here, and this part, what thickness, here, push. This is not a final ink, okay, I can do anything what I want, okay. So this is really better. 
and also exterior. Okay. To the red color. Okay, use quarter inch. You need to measure how far from here, this point, to this point, based on your measurement. Okay, I find it. And how far from here to wall, to wall, you measure that. Okay. And the thickness for this wall, I said uh, one foot five, no, one foot three. Okay. Based on your observation. Okay. Yep. Okay, and the next step, you bring down. Very serious drawing. Use use T square. I use a I use a, a parallel bar. Okay, here 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 and here and also exterior wall. Okay, maybe eight for the six. Eight for the six. Okay. Okay, I don't know how far down, I just ran down, make it, vertical line, okay, the ran down, make vertical, I don't know how far, then I measure how far is it, this one, measure that based on your observation, okay, keep working. This time, the cross line extend a little bit longer. Later, when you ink it, help you to find a point. Cross line, extend a little bit. Make sure, okay, extend. Go ahead, Subin. Okay. Okay, then you have to measure that part to outside. Slide, I mean, this one slide a little bit different. That's okay. That's not a big deal. Okay. Okay, so this part until here. Okay. And also, this will take a look at here to here. Measurement based on your measurement. Okay, I find this point. Okay. Okay, all the way until here, how far is it? Okay, so this one to here. Take a look at, okay. And also, next step, three for two, right? And a measure from here to here, how far? You are gonna transfer, use a scale, transfer to here. Measure that, how far? Then mark down. Okay, mark down, then vertical line, make it a little bit longer, okay, I make it a little bit longer, slide, that part, for next time, I'm getting working for elevation, okay, but right now, so this is why Christina mentioned about uh, use one sheet of paper, that's uh, several time. If you use a separate paper, still fine, but a uh, little bit longer, okay? If you use one sheet, several time. I'm working this one vertical, extend, elevation, that's okay. Once time I finish that. Okay, see? One, two, three, four. Okay, four right. windows. Measure this one. Outside, give it a. Inside, give it a. One foot of five. Two, one foot of five. Inside, eleven inch. Based on your observation, okay. Inside, eleven maybe. Okay, so like this. I I just shove my pencil. Okay. Just make a double line. One, two, three, four. So this is not final, okay? See? I got the windows. Another You can use a scale to measure.
to measure, okay, to find it, you have no problem to find the center line. 26, 26, half. Okay, roughly is here. Center line. Center line, take a look. I'm going to change to another color of pencil. I'm now using red color. I'm going to use a blue color for center line. Line, dot, line, dot, line, dot. This is center. See? Blue line, which is 9 inch for either side. Okay, 9 inch. So 9 inch. Flip another side. Here, here 9 inch. Okay, then 3 for the 6, right? No, sorry. Three, three, three for the three for two, right? Mm -hmm. Three for the two. Three for two. Okay, so this one, you can measure that. So this is a three for two. One, two. So here, one, two, three. Okay, one for the six. One for the six. Then three for two. One, two, three. Okay. One, two, three, four. Okay. Let me double check. Let me double check. Three, four, six. Oh, I got a mistake. Don't, so this is why you need this one. Three, four, two. I marked down wrong, wrong point. Okay. So you raise or now you raise no problem. This is why three for two, three on two here. Three for two. Okay, I marked down. Then one for the one for the six. Then another three for two. One, two, three. So this page you can do anything you want it. This is not a final trace, okay? Here, here, here. What was this one? Okay, okay. Great, see, I got a window. Window, next step, I'm gonna add a window. I remember that's 11. Okay. Okay. So make a double line. Okay, five for the eleven, which means uh, it's roughly six foot. Okay, five for the eleven. I measure that. Five for the eleven, roughly. It's very close. Five for the six. Five for the eleven. Six foot. Okay. The six foot. Into your cube. Okay. The, which means uh, two and a half. Three inch. Okay. So this here to here, roughly three inch. Three inch, then give it another three inch door. Okay, three inch door here. Okay. Later, I'm gonna add a door swing. Okay. So door swing, make sure door swing, I'm gonna add a door swing. Door swing, no freehand required. Use a 
template. Okay, template. Template required. Okay, not option. This is not option. Okay, yep. So you have to find a three foot. So diameter, this, if you want a three foot radius, you have to find a six foot. Which one is six foot? That's six. This is six. Okay, this is six. Okay, so now I put it here. Okay. Door swing. Okay, door swing. Then door swing. Door. Typical door. One and a three quarter. Okay, so typical the door. You just make a double line. That's okay. Double line. Okay, that's door. And also, okay, I'm keep working this part. Okay, so here, extend to here. Or to here. And also this is a door. This part, this side of this is a glass. Glass, just the middle, make a double line. That's look like a glass. Okay. So typically we're working like this. Double line. Make a double line. So this time I may just make one line. When I ink it, I can detail make a double line. Okay. How about this part? This part you measure that door suppose that three foot six inch. One six inch. Okay. Then three foot door. One, two, three, three foot door. Okay, so now, and uh, this this room, wall typical give it a five inch also, five inch. Okay, five inch. So that's five inch, just measure five inch. Okay. So this part five inch also. Okay. Inch. And inside, we don't know yet. Is that no? I never opened that. Okay, we just estimate. Okay, to estimate, estimate. We don't care about that. We don't know yet. We just uh, extend this wall. I don't know. I never been inside. Okay, that's just a start. I just extend. Maybe like that. Okay, and also door. This door, door, door size, the, the, the door panel, we give it a roughly maybe one and a half is quarter inch scale, quarter inch scale, okay, the door, and also make sure, give it a three foot, you can, you can play two, three, Three until here. Then I use the template again. That's a required template, not option. Okay. Make sure required template, not option. Okay. Okay. So I get a door. I have a scale. This one. Four. Four. Four center. Zero. Four. Eight. See. Okay. So this one. Okay. Then thickness, this one. one. Thickness. Six. Five. Right. Five. Okay, five. Measure that. Measure. Five inch. Six go back one unit. Six back one unit. Okay. For quarter inch scale, each unit, which is an inch. So for quarter inch scale, very difficult to find a, find a half. Okay, half, just offset a little bit, quarter inch. Okay, so right now, take a look at maybe from here, three to six until here. Okay, so if you want to monitor here, Go ahead and go get a dash line. 
Sí. Why from here? We're right now. Okay, right now. From here. I'll make a guideline. Not push too hard. Not push too hard. Barely see that. Okay. Three, one and a half. Uh, one and a half. That's three. One, two, three. Here to here. The wave. Oh, I forgot how, how, how much is this. The three and a half, right? Three and a half. Yeah. Three foot and a half. Three foot a six inch. Okay. Uh, three foot a six inch. Three foot a six. Another three foot. Three foot a six. Three foot a six. Okay, see? Yeah. Let me make this one, this desk. Okay. Okay, another side. Then this uh, this is center center. Another, make sure another three for the six. Make sure you use the right scale. Three for the six. One, two, three for the six. Then three foot space. One, two, three. And three for the six. Okay. Here. 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 Great. Okay. So now, uh, look. Let's say one half. You got wrong. Okay. Two for the seven quarter inch. Two for the. You can find it. You can to find the seven. Okay. Okay. Now. See, I can push harder. Anyway, we can ink later. And also, three foot, One, two, three foot, another two foot uh, seven, two foot seven. Okay. If I pre draw this one, make it very light. Okay, very light first. Then push harder. Okay. We get a desk. Okay. See. Okay, so you get a desk. So depth one for the give leave the space one foot uh, nine. Okay. Okay. Let's control that. Very light, not push too hard. Okay, so chair still, desk roughly you still find a center point. That's that typical perfect. Okay. Center. Two. Then you give it uh, how much? I said you give it a you give it a, you can give it one for the six. Okay, that's no problem. Give it wider one for the six. Okay, one 
for the six, and for here to here. And for the six here to here. Okay. And for the six. Okay, here. Okay. So you can you can one by one just to add more detail. I'm not working all detail. I just make one one of these. Okay. So sometimes the chair, if you want to make a chair better, this one just that you make it. That one. Fringe. You make a double line, look like a back. Okay. That's it. Okay. Look like it. We have that. No, this is center. It's up to you. Maybe easy to remember. Uh, if 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 you wanna, sometimes this page. Uh, for example, if you wanna, okay, fine. Oh, I know this is wall. I know this is wall. Here's wall. For you, easy to remember. Never forget it. You can shade that. No, I don't care. I don't need this page. I don't need this page. I need a final trace, ink drawing. Okay, so you easy, you're easy to remember. Okay, so this is column. I know that's column. I'm not greedy for this page. Okay, here easy to remember. Here, this is this is wall, wall, wall. Oh, it's solid. You're solid. Okay, this page I'm not great. I great. Okay, from here measure. Okay, measure. We add a cabinet here. Quarter inch. Two, one and a half. Two one and a half is very difficult. Is one little bit until here. And this side with slide go back. Maybe give it a six foot. Okay, cabinet. That's a building. That's included here. Okay. Here to here. That's it. Nothing. See? Just to make this box. See that? That's all you want. That's it. Dimension is option. This is not your one. So I only care dimension from here, here, here. Oh no, no, sorry, sorry. So this is why you use eraser, erase it. So this is why you use pencil. Here, here, here. To here, that's it. Okay. So in a horizontal, horizontal dimension, we just use major dimension. Major Okay. 
nice. Okay. The machine here. Two here. Here. That's all major dimension I give it. Okay. Uh, anyway, if you want to add more fun, uh, the panel text I'm going to write down from here before I transfer. Uh, I can make a guideline, maybe in the middle. I make a furniture plug call. Start from here. And I give the guideline space to give you enough space. Space. Use the true size. Okay, this one to here. And also scale, don't forget. Okay, and make a guideline. Make a guideline. Okay. So from here, this is a, a we call the furniture plan. So right. This is a furniture plan. I go right down here. So this is why I need to use a free hand right now first. Take a look at is that too too big or too small? We can adjust. Okay, furniture floor plan scale. Three inch. No, no, sorry. Quarter. Quarter. You write down the. Zero, one slash four inch equal. I get a trouble. I don't have enough space. So this is why this is not. This page is not final. Okay, so I need to shift everything to the left side. Leave it. Okay, maybe I write down here. So later, I'm gonna erase. Okay, this is a furniture. Maybe here. For T furniture, furniture floor plan, then scale, scale zero, one slash four inch equal one foot zero inch. So now it's better. Okay, I got a furniture floor plan. Scale, quarter, Get that shape. Ink it. I'm gonna ink it. So I put on the top. Okay. Put on the top. I'm gonna ink it. Ink it. Ink put on the top. Okay, ink it. But I do think right now, better before ink. I'm going to make the. But anyway, ink. That's next step. But before ink, I would see the maybe the. Uh, RCP. Okay, RCP typical. We working same time. This one RCP. RCP reflect ceiling plan. Same sheet. Working from this sheet, so I give you idea RCP reflect ceiling plan. Uh, this is why I have red color behind. For me, it's very easy to trace. Okay, for your guys, same thing. You can use color. This is just background. Okay, 
So I can input, I use zero 01, okay, to trace it. Take a look at this time, I'm going to grade your quality this time, okay? Ink it. So typical, I suggest in first layer, you can use 01 or 03. So this time, consider your quality here. Okay, this part. Okay. Keep working. Okay, so this part doesn't matter. We can shade this part. Okay. And also door here. I use zero one. Then working for window double line. Double line. Okay. This is a drafting. Okay. Drafting. Then doors. Cross line, I mentioned before, everybody working for cross line, and also this is a, uh, make sure the, the, circle template, okay, see, uh, this part here, Chair. Okay, I make one chair. A table. Table. Chair. Okay. Then add more details. This is a the wall. Then keep working this part. Here's a uh, the windows. I'm not working for all. Anyway. Okay. Then I finish this part. A demo. Okay. I'm working for vertical. Okay, in kit, a cross line. Series toy for your use a circle template for door swing. Okay. okay, here detail. Take a look at I work in same time to here. I'm not working for all desk. Okay. Chair. This is zero one, zero one. Okay, zero one. Okay. Yeah. 
Sam Pembroke from here. And this is glass, double light. Okay, exterior. Take a look at now. There's one piece of paper behind between that. See, this is great. Part of it's great, high quality. Okay, yeah. But anyway, this is just one layer. One layer cross line. Okay, so. I said it's one lightweight, we have used different lightweight. Okay. Template working. You have to use a circle template required, okay? Required, that's not an option, okay? Required a circle template. It's not an option, make sure, okay? Okay. Circle template. Then here. Okay, this is a this is a metal door. Okay. Oh, got it here. This is a windows. Okay, windows, and another wall here. Okay, and this is is indicate column, 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 and more detail. Okay. Let's uh, check it. Between that. Okay, between that. Uh, here's no lightweights right up. We have add a lightweight. Cutting area here. Here. Take a look at the other line. And also here, be careful. Do not smear your paper. Be careful. Cutting area. You make a bold line. Then, here. Be careful, move your ruler. After you have wait until dry, then yeah. working this step. Okay, pretty much everything is dry. So this is a quality consider, okay? High quality drafting. Okay. Okay. So now take a look at different lightweights, right? Lightweights. So here's the window. So this is a cutting area. This use any black marker, black black pencil, and also be careful. Do not touch your drawing. No touch your drawing to protect your drawing. To protect, okay. Ink always ink first, then spend time. Okay. That's wool cutting. That's wool. Here. Okay. 
Yeah. Yeah. It's very important you have a fine line, beautiful edge. You cannot direct use use a ruler to apply this type of brush. Okay, so this part. You can use sharpie. Yeah, this is a. I use this pencil. Sharpie is similar. Okay. Yeah. Or you can find a Sakura micro pen. You can find a, that's called B, which means brush. See. Just apply that. Anyway, this is a time issue. They they step. Wait wait until. You can wait wait uh, wait until last weekend. Okay, do that. Because this one, if you do this one, it's very difficult to modify. Okay, so you can wait. You don't have, and also time issue, you don't have wasted your time to work in right now. Okay, so for example, like here. So here, typical. Work in this. See, if you're working like this, just read better. Just time issue. Yeah, just keep working. Okay, just keep working. So for the for this part, this part we are not going to color. So this part we color. This time issue, okay. We color. I put this paper to here to protect my drawing, okay. So very easy to distinguish. This is a cabinet, okay. 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 Just time issue. You can use a black marker, maybe several times. Maybe fat. Also, see? Black. That's black. Take a look at. That's everything black. That's structure. That's structure. Take a look at. Black. Okay. That's structure. Keep working. Okay. Yep. Keep working. Okay. Detail. Yeah, you have to add more details. You have to use a uh, zero one. Zero one. Okay. So detail, which means dash line. Oh, by the way, this one too. The glass. I forgot the double line. And uh, this is a. Uh, TV, mount TV, dash line, okay, dash line, then here, dash line, okay, your dimension, okay, so this part here, I have a guideline here. Then from here to here, this point, this point, here to here, then to here. Okay, then I'm going to use a architecture teak. I can use a 45 degree triangle. Here. Okay. 
okay so major i said major not too many dimension like you did i use a zero one then use a, this paper put it here you just write down i don't know exactly this i only know this one remember this is i have a guideline a foot dash zero inch a foot dash zero okay so i cannot remember this this number is a uh, six six for three okay go back check your hand out okay and i can remember okay six foot three inch for example i just write that put it here okay so this is what i know you you, you just go at, at another dimension okay and also text i can make smaller oh it's okay this one Furniture. Floor plan. Then scale. Okay, zero foot dash one slash four inch equal one foot dash zero okay and also sometimes use auto find if you want to make it looking better you can make one guideline behind that this is just for graphic for graphic okay now i put it here Furniture, floor plan. Okay. Furniture. Okay. Yeah. Well, for these onto your door. Two, two, two foot. This part. Two foot. Here. Here, two foot. Okay. So sometimes. We show that dash line zero one. You show dash line here to find to here. Sometimes just to show dash line. Okay, and vertical dash also. Okay, so this one indicated the space from your floor plan. Take a look at floor plan, only thing reflects ceiling plan without. Don't make door swing. No door swing, okay, no furniture. Okay, so typical reflect ceiling plan just to show whatever represents the, the tile. Okay, so anyway, I still can use this sheet. I use a, another color of pencil. I can use another color of pencil. Blue color. My blue color here, blue color. Blue color, you just mark down. Or you can use another piece of, but you don't have to, silly, you don't have to retrace everything. It's not required to retrace everything, okay? Just to go ahead and find. Okay, this is two, two, two foot. Here's two. Oh, I said here two foot. Oh, I got a mistake. I said two foot. Stop was from here. Two foot. Here, here, two foot. Color. And here, here. Two foot to here. So which means from here. Then this part. From here. Okay, so I have a different color for this page. I know this is A. Okay, see? I make this one. Okay. 
Okay.